What is going on guys? Cade Zero Supercision here and we're going to look at my combat record because as you can see I have now hit Grandmaster Prestige. It took me nine months and I'm ready for Black Ops 3 but we, we're going to roll right through my stats and see what it took for me to get to this spot that I am here now. So we're going to start right here. Career, it took me 85,000 kills, almost a 1.1 KD, 0 0.85 win-loss ratio. I quit out of a lot of games plus I played min Momentum a lot which a lot of times ended in a tie of almost a 340 score per minute almost 1900 wins 9 million score best game modes momentum and domination and team deathmatch are my top three and then free for all came up because i started playing one shot a lot with a 3.78 win loss ratio i'll take that uh kill confirmed hard point if you guys want to see these just i don't know there it is for you Weapons, 36,000 kills with the Moors, the 1.13 KD, and 51% accuracy and 2,800 headshots. Then you got the TAC-19 with 73% accuracy, and you can see the rest of those stats. AS-1, because that is the god gun of this game, so you got to use that from time to time if you want to try hard. The Lynx, that is my sniper whenever I play hardcore, which I do play quite a bit. Not as much as I do one-shot, but still quite a bit. ARX, this is where I, this is basically the gun I use in hardcore when I'm not sniping. Bow, back when I was popular, KF5 for switches, and then I have royalty for every single gun in this game except for launchers, but it still gave me the exosuit for some reason. I'm not quite sure why, but I'm not complaining. So I'll just run through the rest of these guns just so you can see. So yeah, I at least got a kill with every gun except for the riot shield. Maybe I'll work on that. Into for next combat record before Black Ops 3 comes out, which probably won't, the stats probably won't have changed that much. Exo Launcher, I use mostly the Spike Drone, and I occasionally use a Variable Grenade from one shot. And then the rest of these, I'm not even sure how I used, got anything with these, because I don't even use these. Did I ever get any kills with the Explosive Drone? I actually got, nope, I did not. The Score Streaks, UAV, mostly, pretty much, yeah. And then remote turret systematic care package. You can see the rest of these as they go along. All right, medals. I've got almost 5,700 headshots. Wow, I've got a ton of medals. 2,000 long shots, 1,200 paybacks. Have thrown four grenades back to people. 3,800 one-shot kills. Well, 3,900 pretty much. So. A lot of those are snipers and shotguns, probably. Let's see here, what else we got? Almost 5,000 double kills, 500 triple kills, 45 multis, five five-man multis, and one six-man multi kill, which I'm still happy with. They got 240 merciless medals here, 44 relentless, 12, 44 ruthless, 12 relentless, five brutal. And I got a vicious medal twice. I've only gotten one DNA bomb though. But that was still quite a kill streak, I'll admit that one. And then smashed over 237 people, skewered 307 people with the re no, not the recon drone, it's the uh, spike drone. That's right. And the rest 367 collaterals, not bad. 11 boomerangs, I don't even remember any of them. What is Secretary of Defense again? Oh yeah, with Exo Trophy. Not important. And then if you guys want to see any of these, well, right here. Anti-score streaks. Game modes. I've captured 2,800 flags. Just a lot of... Huh. I don't really know what to say about these. And then... We can go ahead and run through my calling cards. So I've got all but these three here on that one. I've got most of the game mode ones except for Infected, Search and Destroy, Search and Rescue, and Uplink. But the rest of those I have. I have Hardpoint, PDM, Momentum, Kill Confirm, Domination, Free For All, Capture the Flag. Got all those. I don't have as many of the exosuit things because I don't use equipment very much. I really don't. And then I got that one, which I'm kind of working on somewhat. And then the weapons, I've got all but like these four. The shield, Maws, Mayhem, MBL, basically the explosive, and then the riot shield. 
but I still got these calling cards for some reason. Not sure still. I'm not sure why it gave me it, but I'm not complaining. Still, I got all the calling cards for the attachments, of course. All but these two for the perks. Maybe I should start working on those as well. Score streaks. I've got all but the paladin and the warbird. I'm getting closer. Wild cards. All but these two. I'm sure I could probably get these. Those don't look too hard. And then finally got all of the prestige calling cards. That one looks so cool. The clans. I got all the clan calling cards. And yeah, I only bought these four. I didn't need to buy the other ones. And let's see what else I got here. The emblems. We could look at emblems real fast. Basically, here's all the stuff that I have unlocked. I'm sure you guys could probably find these on your own and see what they do because I don't think I want to even run through these because they're pretty mundane tasks. And a lot of these are like tiers up to getting the calling cards for the equipment and the game modes so it's nothing too big and then here's a quick run through of the calling cards again not bad and let's see is there anything else I can look at I guess we go leaderboards I guess let's see what we got here 12,000th in the world or at least on the world of PlayStation 4300 in Team Deathmatch don't really play that much 25th hundred in free for all I'm actually surprised about that 5400 thousand then kill confirmed 14 thousand then capture the flag 104 thousand and uplink and I'm still 140th in momentum not bad I'll definitely take that jeez that's a that's horrible for search and destroy bad for search and rescue pretty good for domination 62 thousand not bad 43 thousand and hard point really bad and infected and really bad in gun game, so I guess not much to witness there. I guess while I'm at it, I could also show you guys my armory, so that way you guys could see that as well. And let's look at my redeemables real fast. So I got the AK-12, the Obsidian Steed, Money, Ransacker, Templar, Quick Bolt, Silver, Poner, Volchex, One Wood, Sledgehammer, Roundhouse. The Roundhouse is my favorite variant of the shotgun, even though the Sledgehammer has like an extra magazine and better hip fire. Just the fact that you can move faster and it fires a little faster and has a little extra range it just completely makes up for it to me. Bulldog Carnage, Quarterback, see all these ones. Got the Insanity and the Strider and the Speakeasy, Pearl Pipe, the Goliath, Loophole, Ravager, Rail Driver, Chicken Eerie, the Gigawatt, Royalty, and I got my first set of Legendary, and I'll definitely enjoy that. Got the Atlas 20 Miller Royalty the other day, and Man, was I excited to get that one. And now we can look at... What, what do I still have here? Ah, oh, just Red Baron stuff and Bloodshed. Not bad. And then I've got pretty much all the Marksman variants for just about every gun. I've got the Weapons Master stuff and the Grand Master stuff, the Zombies, Atlas Campaign, Marksman. I have all this stuff. You can see all of this here. Got the Centurion gear. I got all the Centurion gear. I also got the Atlas Campaign Veterans Mask. What else is there to withhold? 124 items. And yeah, that's about everything I have. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed this video. Comment, subscribe. I will reply to anything you guys say, and I will appreciate any feedback you guys can give me. I will also appreciate if you follow me along. And So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.